Hello, people. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Hi. How are you? Good evening. Good evening. Are you viendo where are you? No. Yes. Ya pasó. Ah, ya pasó. Ya pasó. Se vino para acá. Se les fue para allá. Sí, porque sí. Eh, en las noticias estaba viendo que en, en la capital ha habido un montón de árboles caídos. De verdad. Sí, wow. así que tienen que tener cuidado. Y es que es, es, fue bien fuerte y con viento, en cuestión de media hora se fue la energía como tres veces. Bueno, por lo menos aquí se fue como tres veces. Así que... ¿Y de dónde está usted? Estoy aquí por la salida de a San Salvador. Estoy por Walmart, Constitución. Ah, ok, ok. Ajá, ajá. Está lloviendo, pero no muy fuerte ahorita. Ya está pasando, entonces. Teacher. Hola. Yo tengo el mismo problema de que estoy trabajando y eh, mi teléfono no puedo ponerle audífonos. Entonces voy a hacer lo mismo que hice ayer, que me voy a poner el teléfono cerca del oído para poder escuchar. Ah, ya pues. Oh, my goodness. Amerita un cafecito esta tormenta. Sí. Es eh, Erson con cara de ardilla. Ya comieron a Nona. Good evening. No, sí o no. Están oyendo. Aún no. <risa> no. Ayer quise comprar una ahí en Santa Tecla. Cuatro dólares me pidieron. Exagerado, pero ni las uvas. Nos querían estafar. ¿Ah? No querían estafar. Y era, y, y era el único lugar donde había. Algo y, yo siento, y yo siento caro que me digan dos dólares aquí por donde vivo. 
No. Tampoco es para tanto el deseo. No, pero ahora publicó alguien aquí en la urna en Facebook a dólar a unos 40, lo más grande. Es que ya le encargué. ¿Quién quiere? ¿Quién, ¿Quién quiere? ¿Quién quiere? Hagamos negocio aquí. Reventa, reventa. Okay, people, let's get started with the first attendance of the evening. Alberto José Hernández. Present. Excellent. Very good. Amilcar de Nilsson González. Present. Perfect. Carlos Josué Hernández. Presente. Excellent. David Alberto Rivera. Presente. Hey. David Otoniel Martínez. Presente. Excellent. Fidel Ángel Aguilera. Hi, teacher, here. Hello. Gabriel Alonso Ponce. Gabriel Alonso. Gerson Orlando Deodanes. Present. Okay. Ella me va a enseñar cómo poner esa ardillita. <risa> Iván Alberto Castillo. Iván Alberto Castillo. José Osvaldo Valle. José Osvaldo Valle tampoco. María José Portillo. Present teacher. Hey. María Julia Ramos. Present teacher. Hey. A ver que así se llamaba mi abuelita. Exactamente. María Julia Ramos. Qué bueno, bonito nombre. Sí, eh, sí. sí una, una compañera mía, la mamá tiene, se llama igual. Entonces, por escribirle a la mamá, me escribe a mí. <risa> Pero lo que ella era Ramos Bonilla. Ramos Bonilla y soy Ramos Olivar. Okay. Marni Betsaida Hernández. Present. Hey, welcome. Miguel Ángel Romero. Present. Perfect. Patricia Noemí Girao. Patricia Noemí, todavía oh. sí. Rafael Antonio Martínez. Rafael tampoco. Rodolfo Alexander Fernández. Rodolfo Alexander Fernández. Present teacher. Ok, ahora sí. Eh, tengo problemas con el Inter, teacher. Bueno, a la que funcione. Es... Fanny Janet Flores. Present teacher. Excellent. Victor Antonio Benítez. Victor Benítez. Todavía no. Victor Manuel Avilés. Present teacher. Perfect. Alguien que ya entró y que 
No estaba cuando pasé la lista. Ah, ah Iván. Ok, Iván. Ya te vi, ya te vi. Iván Albert. Ok. Okay, tonight we con we are going to continue with unit two, but now with lesson two, always talking about daily routines. Topic is daily routines. Yes. So, particularly at work. Daily routines at work. Um, yeah. Today's objective is describe a partner's daily routine at work. Okay, you are now you are going to talk not about your routine, but a co-worker routine. Okay. Um, we have two questions here to start. What is your daily routine? What is your daily routine? Hmm. Can you think about that? What is your daily routine? Well, let me show you about my daily routine, for example. Or let me. There is word. Ah. Bien, a ver cómo se usa esto, dibujar, dibujar. Ok. ¿Pueden ver la pizarra? Esta es la primera vez que la voy a usar aquí. Esta nueva Bien. herramienta de yes. Zoom. Okay, for example, my daily routine. I uh, get up at I pena decirle a am. I'm sorry, I work late, so I go to bed at midnight. I get up at 9 a.m. Actually, I, I wake up, you know, let, let me. Oh. Actually, I wake up at 5 a.m. I wake up at 5 a.m. Me despierto at 5 a.m. Because my wife, mi esposa, is a teacher. She works in a school. So, 
and I listen to the alarm and I wake up her. So yo la despierto a ella. At 5 a.m. Pero I fall asleep again. And wake up again. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. And then I get up. Depends. Sometimes at 8. Sometimes at 9. Sometimes early at 7. But usually at 9 a.m. Make. Let me write down. Make breakfast for me and my, my mother. How can I pull this? Oh. Yeah. Well, we have like. I make breakfast for me and my mother. Actualmente, tengo otras clases. I clean the house. I watch TV. I take care of my granddaughter at five. I, well, I have lunch. At 1 p.m., I take care of my granddaughter at 5 p.m. David Alberto, ¿están viendo lo que escribo o no? No, solo hay una flecha. Sí, sí, sí se ve. Sí, se ve una flecha, Leo, nada más. Sí, se puede flecha. ver. Uh, ¿Qué será? ¿Qué será que uno sí lo ven y otro no? Por el internet. Pero, ya se tapó, I wake up. Here. No sé. Estoy aprendiendo a usar esto para primero. Bueno, si no, lo vamos a escribir en el I take care of my granddaughter at 5 p.m. I have dinner at 7 p.m. I teach my class at 8 p.m. Who can see what you share? ¿Qué dice? Aquí dice que todos lo pueden ver. Bueno, voy a ver si. Ok, that is así eh, a grandes rasgos my daily routine. My daily routine. ¿Ah? La voy a poner aquí en, en el chat. Ay, no la copia. No. Copiar, copiar, copiar. Aquí está. Copy. A ver si me lo pega en el chat. Paste. No. Levánteme la mano los que pueden ver eh, la mano virtual. Los que pueden ver la pizarra. Serán los que están en teléfono los que no. Ahí está, quiero ver, alguien más. 
Ah, gracias. Gracias. Buena idea. Alguien lo puso ya en el WhatsApp. So, so that is my daily routine. Ok. Ahorita, pues, no tengo clases. Estoy bastante relax durante el día. Entonces, what I want you to do? Well, write, tal vez no tantas, unas four, three, or four, or five sentences about your daily routine. But, uh, principalmente, at work. ¿Qué hacen en el trabajo? Yeah. Write five sentences about your daily routine at work. Ok. Tenemos unos minutos para hacer eso. Ah, oh, borrar la flecha. No. Please, when you finish, raise your hand. Levanten la mano virtual cuando hayan terminado.
here. One, two, three, four. Ay, faltan varios. Ah. Four or five sentences about your daily routine. Uy, solo cuatro, los demás, Juan. Okay, okay, vamos avanzando. Vamos. Um, escribiendo oraciones sobre tu daily routine. Ahí en el WhatsApp. Hay un ejemplo de las mías. My daily routine. Okay, very good. Here. Oh, uh, yeah, sí, pero puedes anotarlo ahí en Instagram. Ah, ok. Ok. Voy a colocarlos en grupos unos minutitos para que compartan. About your daily routine. Okay. Okay. Go to your groups, please, and talk about your daily routines. One moment. One minute. Pónganse a los grupos, please. Ok. 
entren a los grupos para compartir su nómina.
Okay. <clears throat> Very good. A ver, volunteers to talk about their daily routine. Volunteers. I am teacher. Okay, Amilcar. Okay, I wake I wake up at two forty five a.m. and then I wake up at three a.m. After I take a shower, brush my teeth, and wearing my clothes. Then I take the bus at three and a half a.m. and arrive at five o'clock to work. After I breakfast and give security to every place. Okay. Very good. Very good. One more. One. Only one. No more volunteers? Teacher. Okay. My daily routines. I wake up at six in the morning. I take a bath at six, uh, a.m. I leave for work at seven in the morning. I return, return home daily around 6 um, 13 p.m. Okay. Very good. Very good. One more. Only one. One, two, person. I get up at 7 p.m. 7 a.m. Sorry. I drink coffee before at work. I am computer for work. I start work at 8 o'clock. 8 at at the, the night 7 a.m. into two daily meeting for talk about the activity of the day. What activity we are make at 11, at 11 have, have lunch, um, one o'clock return to work in the, after, in the afternoon. I live, I live at the 5.30 p.m. Okay, perfect. And Maria Julia, levantó la mano. Yes, my daily routine is I get up at five in the morning. I I make I breakfast for and my husband. I am going to work. I am start work at eight. Um, I review report and document. I have lunch at 1 p.m. I leave work at 5 in the afternoon. I have dinner at um, 7 afternoon. I teach my class at 8. Okay, perfect. Okay. Yo sé que todos quieren participar y hablar y contarme, pero ahorita... Later, okay, later. <clears throat> let's see, let's continue with this conversation. We have this conversation in the book. Share the screen. I'm going to read the conversation and I'm going to record the conversation here. Listen, good morning, Cindy, how are you? Fine, I have many things to do this week. 
But Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. She is so busy. And on weekends? One more time. Pay attention. Just listen. Let me get the point. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine, I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. She is so busy. And on weekends? Now repeat, please. Repeat after me. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Good morning, How are you? Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. The new secretary. The new secretary. The new secretary. Her very is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. On Monday, Monday, she makes many phone, phone, phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. Later, Later she writes reports about, about the production. production. And what does she do the other days? And what does and what she, does she do, do the other days? The other days. The other day. On Wednesday, she sent some emails to the bookkeeper. On Wednesday, she sent some emails to the bookkeeper. To the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. And on Friday, Friday, she arranges meetings. She is so busy. And on weekends? She is so busy. And on weekends. Okay, very good. Now, uh, let's practice. Now, I am Janet. And you are Cindy, okay? I am Janet and you are Cindy. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. 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 I have many things to do this, this quick week. But Katie is very bad. bad. Really? Who is Katie? 
The new secretary has issued a very high Monday, she makes a call. The report about the production. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some email to the bookkeeper. On Friday, she arranged meetings. She is so busy. And on weekends? Okay. Now let's switch. You are Janet and I am Cindy. You begin. One, two, three. Good morning, Cindy. Good morning. How are you? How are you? Fine. Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? really? Who is Katie? Who is Katie? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And, and what uh, does she do the other day? She do the other day. She do the other day. On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper, and on Friday, she arranges meetings. She, she is, is so busy. Uh, 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 okay. Yes, that's right. Very good. Now I'm going to send you to work in pairs and I want you to practice this conversation, okay? In pairs. And after that, I want you to complete the chart with Katie's information or Katie's activities, okay? You have the activities for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. And uh, you have to imagine the, the activities for the weekend and write one activity per day. So, imagínense las actividades que hace Katie en el weekend. Weekend es Saturday and Sunday. Okay. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday are weekdays. Weekdays. And Saturday and Sunday are, are the weekend. So in the conversation, you have Katie's activities for weekdays. Some weekdays. Tal vez no todos, pero algunos weekdays. Y Saturday and Sunday, invent, imagine and write Katie's activities for Saturday and Sunday. Ok, eso lo van a hacer en parejas. First, practice the conversation. Many times, muchas veces, practice, practice, practice. Pueden escucharla y la tenían en WhatsApp. And then complete exercise three. Complete the chart about Katie's activities. Okay. Let me form the, the groups. Van en parejas. Si es que. Eh, por favor, no se quede nadie fuera. Porque me dejan a alguien solo. Van de dos. Entren a los grupos, please. No me aparece la opción, Tisha. Porque oh. somos 17, quizás. Sorry, I'm sorry. No le había dado. El... Bueno. Ahorita.
Iván, ¿estás ahí? Iván.
Vale, muchas gracias. No, no. Bye. Bueno, entonces el, tenemos que el lunes eh, make many phone calls eh, she write a report about y the production y Wednesday send some email to the bookkeeper and Friday she arrange your meeting Okay. Let's see. I need to take the second attendance of the evening. So please turn on your cameras and respond. Alberto Jose Hernandez. Present. Okay. Amil Cardenilson González. Present. Okay. Carlos Josué Hernández. Presente. Good. David Alberto Rivera. Presente. Okay. David Otoniel Martínez. Presente. Okay. Fidel Ángel Aguilera. Hi, teacher. Okay. Uh, Gabriel Alonso Ponce. Here. Okay. 
Gabriel, los 10 minutos al final de la clase son contigo esta noche, ¿ok? Gerson Orlando okay, okay. Teodanes. Present. Okay. Iván Alberto Castillo. Eh, José Osvaldo Valle. María José Portillo. Sí. María Julia Ramos. Present. Ok. Marni Betsaida Hernández. Present. Ok. Miguel Ángel Romero. Present. Ok. Patricia Noemí Guirao. Rafael Antonio Martínez. Presente. Ok. Rodolfo Alexander Fernández. Present, teacher. Ok. Stephanie Janet Flores. Present, teacher. Good. Víctor Antonio Benítez. Present. Ok. And Víctor Manuel Aviles. Present. Okay, very good. Now I like to hear your conversations. Okay. Let's see. Qué barbaridad. A ver, David, Otoniel y uh, Stephanie. Please. Present the conversation. Okay. 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 Ready. Okay. Adelante. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. How many things to do this weekend? But Kathy is very busy. Ready? Who is Kathy? The new secretary. Her, shul her shoulder is very thin on Monday. She makes money. Phone call, phone call. Later she white report about the production. And what do it? She do the under days. On Wednesday, the the no, she did, she she sent some with me to the book bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranged me meetings. Meeting. She is busy and on weekends. Okay, very good. Thank you. Now, Alberto, Jose, and Victor Antonio, please present the conversation. Hello. I'm Cindy. Victor, Janet. Okay. Good morning, Cindy. Who are you? No, empezamos. But fine. I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule 
is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls, letters, she writes reports about production. And what does, what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. She's busy, busy. And um, on the weekends? Uh, okay, that's it. Very good. Thank you. Okay. Now, Carlos and Maria Julia. Okay. Uh, good morning, Cindy. How are you? Maria Julia. Okay. Uh, comenzamos, porfa, porque estaba lloviendo. Okay. okay. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. I have many things to the to this week, but Katie is very boy is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary is her schedule is very is very high. Time. On Monday, she make money, money phone calls, letters, she, she write report about the production. And what does she do? And, and what does she do the other days? On Wednesday night, she sent some emails to the bookkeeper and on Friday she arranged meeting. She is a busy and weekend. Okay, very good. Now Herson and Miguel Angel. Okay, I'm Cindy Herson. Okay. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. His schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And what doesn't she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper, and on Friday, she arranges meeting. She's uh, busy and on weekends. Okay, thank you. Now, Amilcar and Gabriel. Milcar, okay. Janet. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? <clears throat> Fine. I had many things to do with book catching. It's very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schuler is very dim. On Monday, she might get money from her. Hi. Larry T. Wright report about the production. And what does she do the other day? <clears throat> On Wednesday, she sent some email to the bookkeeper and on Friday, she arranged making. She's so busy and on weekends. Okay. 
Now, Fidel and Victor Manuel. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? Why is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes a report about the production. And what do we she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper. And on Friday, she arranges meetings. She is so busy and a weekend. Okay. And finally, David, Alberto, and Marnie. Okay, I am Janet. Good morning, Cindy. How are you? Fine. I have many things to do this week, but Katie is very busy. Really? Who is Katie? The new secretary. Her schedule is very tight. On Monday, she makes many phone calls. Later, she writes reports about the production. And what does she do the other days? On Wednesday, she sends some emails to the bookkeeper, and on Friday, she arranges meetings. She is so busy, and on weekends. Okay, very good. Thank you. Well, let me focus on some words. This word but it's a devices. Okay, B C. The pronunciation is B C. Very B C. Okay. Por ahí escuché también esta really, really. Este nombre, Katie. Katie. Esta otra. Schedule. Schedule. Her schedule is very tight. Her schedule is very tight. Quiere decir muy apretado. Eh, bueno, esta solo ya la habíamos mencionado antes, pero igual aquí. Bookkeeper. Bookkeeper. And production. Production. Ok. Production. Uh, now, um, I want you to observe these words. She makes, look, she makes, she writes, she sends, she arranges. Those are the actions uh, act, or activities Katie does. The, the, those are Katie's activities. She makes many phone calls. She writes reports. She sends some emails. She arranges meetings. 
Okay. Very good. Now, um, I want to schedule. Yeah, schedule. Schedule. Now, observe this. Yeah, here we're going to use always the simple present. But now with she and he and it o con nombres ¿verdad? que también podemos sustituir por he or she and observe she makes many phone calls he carries boxes into the truck Cindy sends reports to other companies. It helps workers be on time. My boss talks about the new rules. If you observe todos los verbos, all the verbs, terminan con S. Make makes. Carry carries, send, sends, help, helps, talk, talks. Eso sucede cada vez que los usamos con he, she, o it. He, she, o it. Que son, es lo que se conoce como third person singular, tercera persona singular he, she, it la tercera persona la primera es I la segunda es you la tercera he, she, it en singular porque estamos hablando de una persona ok entonces eh, cada vez que usamos un verbo con he, she or it Vamos a utilizarlo con una, esta S al final. Más adelante vamos a. Now, the negative form. Hablando de las actividades que uno, una persona no hace. No yo, sino él o ella. She doesn't make many phone calls. He doesn't carry boxes into the truck. Cindy doesn't send reports to other companies. He doesn't help workers be on time. My boss doesn't talk about the new rules. ¿Qué es este doesn't? Bueno, este doesn't es la unión de does not. Does not is does. Observen que a diferencia de lo que vimos ayer, ayer veíamos que, que se utilizaba el don't. I don't, you don't, we don't, they don't. Do not, don't. Pero hoy no vamos a utilizar cuando usamos he or she or it no usamos do sino does she doesn't make he doesn't carry Cindy doesn't send he doesn't help my boss doesn't talk y a diferencia de acá ustedes ven ya no se usa la S En affirmative statements o oraciones afirmativas decimos She makes many phone calls. Pero ya en la negativa She doesn't make many phone calls. He carries boxes. He doesn't carry. Cindy sends reports. Cindy doesn't send It helps workers. It doesn't help workers. 
My boss talks. My boss doesn't talk. Solo para que observen. Ok, entonces, con esto en mente. Uh, vamos a completar acá estas oraciones. Algunas son afirmativas, otras son negativas. Las que son negativas, aquí se les pone, ¿ve? El not. Las otras serían afirmativas. Solo con el verbo, ¿verdad? Entre paréntesis, este verbo lo van a escribir en la forma adecuada. ¿Cuál sería? Veamos el primer caso, por ejemplo. He, He orders. Orders, correcto. ¿verdad? He orders uh, everything in the office. Y así sucesivamente. Les voy a dar unos minutos para que hagan esto. Los voy a colocar en, en grupos para que puedan trabajar en ese. Ok, únanse a los grupos y hacen ese ejercicio, por favor. Anuncie los grupos, please.
Okay. Let's see. Number one, he orders everything in the office. Number two, Amy and Teresa. Amy and Teresa. Asks. Asks. Asks for the signatures every Friday. Without the S. Hola. No. No scratching. La segunda sin la S. That's the no, 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 no. Oh. Amy and Teresa ask. Yes. Ask. Correct. Helen. Doesn't go. Doesn't. Oh. Helen doesn't call the design department on week. Or she links. Yes. Or desks in the morning. Five. I right. right, 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 right. A list with the things we need at 9 a.m. And six, Mario doesn't keep, doesn't, doesn't. Yes. Mario doesn't keep a record of the merchandise. He buys. Buys. Sure. Okay. Let me read the sentences. Y grabarse va a sacar también. One, he orders everything in the office. Two, Amy and Teresa ask for the signatures every Friday. Three, Helen doesn't call the design department on weekends. Four, she cleans our desks in the mornings. Five, I write a list with the things we need at 9 a.m. Six, Mario doesn't keep a record of the merchandise he buys. Okay, please repeat after me. Let's practice this uh, sentence. Repeat. He orders everything in the office. He orders everything in the office. In the office. Two. Amy and Teresa ask for the signatures every Friday. Amy and Teresa ask for the signatures every Friday. 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 Three. Helen doesn't call the design department on weekends. Helen, Helen doesn't Helen call the design, design, design department, 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 department on weekends. weekends. She cleans our desks in the mornings. She cleans, she cleans our desks in the mornings. I write a list with the things we need at 9 a.m. I write a list with things we need at 9 p.m. 9 p.m. Mario doesn't keep a record of the merchandise he buys. 
Mario, 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 ¿Alguna pregunta, Pipo? Eh, Mamá, ¿me voy a comprar el jueves? ¿Va a querer algo el jueves? No. Vamos entonces. Un 6 voy a querer para el jueves. Ah, en su micrófono, niños. Bien. Um, what time is it? Okay. A lot of time. Okay. I want you to write sentences about people in your work. Decir, ayer me escribieron al final, ¿verdad? Hicimos eh, este cuadrito donde anotaron uno de sus tres compañeros, ¿verdad? Lo que ellos hacen. Entonces, quiero que me hagan una oración hablándome de ellos. Por ejemplo, voy a escribir aquí un nombre hipotético. Uh, supongamos que yo anoté aquí a alguien que se llamaba Andrés. Andrés. Andrés es uh, okay. a human resource. ¿Verdad? Y vimos aquí que un human resources specialist knows the policies and regulations involved in the management of employees. Escribir eso. Y oh, voy a poner el nombre. Andrés knows the policies and regulations involved in the management of employees. Ay, se me quedó la R. Esto es lo que hace Andrés. Ah, no, en lo que yo. Andrés knows the policies and regulations involved in the management of employees. ¿Verdad? Entonces, ustedes tienen ahí información de otros compañeros que quiero que me hagan oraciones de esta manera. Recuerden el verbo la S. ¿Está claro? Ok. Escriban oraciones acerca de sus compañeros. El cuadrito que llenaron ayer tiene la información de lo que sus compañeros hacen. Entonces háganme la oración hablando de ello.
Okay, mientras trabajan, I'm going to take the last attendance of the evening, okay? Alberto José Hernández. Present. Okay. Amilcar de Nilsson González. Present. Okay. Carlos José Hernández. Presente. David Alberto Rivera. Presente. Okay. David Otoniel Martínez. Presente. Fidel Ángel Aguilera. Micrófono. Ok. Gabriel Alonso Ponce. Gabriel, ok. Gerson Orlando de Odanes. Iván Alberto Castillo. José Osvaldo Valle. María José Portillo. María Julia Ramos. Present. Ok. Marni Betsaida Hernández. Present. Good. Miguel Ángel Romero. Present. Ok. Patricia Noemi Girao. Rafael Antonio Martínez. Rafael Antonio Martínez. Present. Present teacher. Ok. Rodolfo Alexander Fernández. Present teacher. Ok. Stephanie Janet Flores. Ok. Víctor Antonio Benítez. Present. Ok. And Víctor Manuel Avilés. Víctor Manuel Avilés. Ya no está. Ok, people. A ver, ya es hora. Eh, mañana vemos esas oraciones. ¿Verdad? Así es que eso sería todo por hoy. Have a good night. Me quedo good night, con... Good night, good night teacher. Y el Ponce. Bye. Good night. Good night, people. See you tomorrow. Bye, bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Ok, Gabriel, estos 10 minutitos son para resolver alguna duda. Si tienes algo que aclarar, que, que quieras reforzar. Eh, eh, ahorita lo que estaba viendo, hay clases que no, no he podido tomar. Pues ya, por ejemplo, al inicio de la clase no sé qué es lo que dijeron. ¿no? Uh... ¿Escuchan? Sí, bueno, al inicio revisamos la, la, la conversación. Dieron una práctica de, de escribir algunas actividades diarias de cada uno. Y con respecto a la plataforma, una pregunta. La semana pasada hicimos una tarea. Uh -huh. cinco preguntas en cada, en cada día. Uh -huh. Ahora, eh, con esto, siempre se, ¿cómo se llama? Siempre se mantienen las cinco actividades. Sí, usualmente es igual. 
No voy a ver, Fermín, esos cinco. O sea, son cinco por. ¿Cómo se llama? Son cinco por día. Sí, normalmente son cuatro o cinco preguntas, ¿verdad? Por, por cada día. Hoy estamos ya en la unidad dos. Ver, sección dos. Comenzamos ayer. Ahora en esta sección, bueno, hay una tarea por día. ¿Verdad? Ayer fue la clase seis. Hola, teacher, se me fue el internet, se me fue la luz, me habían dicho. Hola. Ah, bueno, ya, ya terminamos. Ah, Ahorita entiendo. Solo estoy con, con Gabriel. De acuerdo. Ok. Bueno, bueno ya te marco ahí la asistencia, ok. Bueno, muchas gracias. Bueno. Sí, ¿verdad? Entonces es la tarea 6, que la de ayer. Ya la tarea 7 sería la de la clase de hoy. Tarea 8, tarea 9, tarea 10. ¿Verdad? Son las de esta semana. Pero aparte de las tareas, para este viernes tienen que también hacer el examen de medio curso, que es este. ¿Verdad? O sea, por el viernes tienen que haber terminado las cinco tareas uh -huh. y este examen. Que tiene ah, okay. cuatro partes. Cuatro partes. Parte uno, parte dos, parte tres, parte cuatro. Ok. Y eso, con respecto a eso, lo puedo hacer, puedo comenzar esa parte antes de la clase o tengo que esperar la clase. No, tú puedes ir, ir, ir avanzando, ir haciéndolo anticipadamente, no hay problema. Ah, ok, ah, ok. Eso te voy a hacer. Una, una pregunta, una pregunta. Cuando finalicemos esa guía, cuando finalicemos a nosotros se nos va a dar algún, algún cartoncito, algún diploma. Sí, Insafor les tiene que otorgar un diploma, ¿verdad? De, del módulo. Eh, media vez tengan el 80% de asistencia. Y una nota mínima de 80 en todas estas tareas y en todos estos exámenes. Que eso aquí mismo en la misma plataforma. Ustedes lo pueden ir viendo aquí donde dice progreso. Aquí tú vas viendo cuánto, cuánto llevas. ¿verdad? Tarea 1 que son todas las tareas de la unidad 1. Acá te lo marca. Tarea 2, tarea 3, tarea 4. Estas son las cuatro semanas. El examen de medio curso. El examen final. Y la nota total. Y el examen final siempre va a ser así con el, este examen. Sí, es, todo es aquí en la plataforma. Ah, okay. ¿Verdad? Ahora, eh, y Insafor, pues, les, a través de inglés corporativo, les tienen que hacer llegar el diploma. Después de... Haber alguna, alguna, no sé, ¿Va a haber algún día específico que vayamos? Eh, ¿Va a ser digital? Eh, creo que es digital para que ustedes lo puedan imprimir. Ah, ok. Tengo otra pregunta acerca de las, de las clases también. Hola.
Hola. Bueno, ya no te veo ni te escucho. Yo escucho por la agua. Está lloviendo ahí. Está lloviendo, está lloviendo. Sí, tocando una gran tormenta. Yo creo que solamente eso era mi duda, lo del diploma y lo de la plataforma, más de todo. Más estamos bien. Bueno, cualquier duda, pues, ahí sabes cómo contactarte conmigo, ¿verdad? Sí, bueno. Vaya, pues, feliz noche. Gracias. Bye, bye.